Joining me now is Dr. Yoshihiro Tuzi, and he is the uh, executive director and, of course, a member of the board of Jogmec, the Japanese national national resources comp uh, company corporation. Thank you so much for taking the time to join us. Tell us a little bit for many of the people that might not be familiar with the work that you're doing mm -hmm. um, at Jogmec. Mm -hmm. uh, we Jogmec, uh, as a governmental organization, uh, we support Japanese private company. Uh, for oil, gas, and metals, and the coals, and the geothermal. So for the securing those resources, uh, we support the Japanese companies financially and technically. Yeah. Now, of course, Japan is, uh, there's big energy demand in Japan. And again, after the unfortunate earthquake and the problems that were after that, there is still huge demand for alternative hydrocarbons. Tell me a little bit how you're coping with all of that. Um, about the uh, after the earthquake, uh, we import about uh, nearly close to uh, twice uh, volume of the hydrocarbons uh, comparing to the previous uh, usage. So we need to um, get more oil and gas and so therefore uh, we need to make a big effort on the exploration and production and especially we hope uh, some more Japanese companies make more effort there. Thank you. Now, of course, uh, the technology that is involved in oil and gas and again something that you really support. Um, tell me a little bit about you know why do you think this What's the next step and what do you need to do? What do companies need to do to really support the technology? Yeah. About the technology, uh, you know that uh, Japan has a very uh, nice technology, advanced technologies in the field of outside of the oil industry. Uh, we are now trying to invite those technologies into the uh, oil industry and make the uh, so oil, uh, oil and gas technologies much more higher. So we are trying, uh, we started uh, such a pro project, uh, te technical solution project uh, last year and hoping uh, to, uh, to invite much more uh, Japanese companies in that field. So um, we had, will have the, also we will have the more collaboration with the NOCs and IOCs. And this year in November, we will have the Techno Forum uh, to talk about uh, such uh, uh, new technologies in oil field, oil uh, industries. Yeah. And of course, this is a very, very important thing for all the companies to actually begin to work together more. Mm -hmm the IOCs, the NOCs, the service companies, and transfer the knowledge and the technology. And is this really what you're also working towards? Yes. Um, we have been having a very long history of the training courses uh, to the uh, NOC people. And also, uh, we do have some collaborative research work uh, with the NOCs. And uh, so, with that, we have carried out uh, some CO2 EOR and also uh, many other uh, oil uh, field uh, development related issues. Yeah. Now, tell me, what are your customers most concerned about? What are the issues that people are talking about now? Um, there may be uh, many issues about the uh, exploration and the production. Of course, uh, we need also eco-friendly development of the oil and gas fields. And uh, for that, um, we are now uh, making a big effort uh, to so carry out such a production method, yes. Now, tell me, at this conference and exhibition here, um, how important is it that of Jogmec is very present here at this? Um, as this is the international uh, technological conference, so in the viewpoint of technology, uh, we think um, we are uh, put, stay, staying here is very important. And in addition to that, um, this is here is Qatar. Uh, we have the uh, MOU with uh, Qatar Petroleum, and also uh, here we are now with JX uh, com uh, oil company, and they are having the exploration in Qatar. So we, there is a possibility that we will support them in this area. So making sure that you visit Qatar, we might see you more often here, will we? Uh, I hope so. I, I'd like to come Qatar again. Yeah, of course.